40 quid is the minimum. You'll have to speak to the agent. Talk to my agent. <laughs> All right, bye then. She's nearly knocked someone out. She was, she was getting all crazy with her hair. I really do. And then she was like that, flaring her arms, and then some young tall girl walked past. <laughs> and she like flew into the chair. It was a nightmare. It's crazy around here, man. London, Islington. We're going to the neighbourhood. Uh, I'm getting one out of you anyway. I thought Yorkshire men were interested in me. Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm good, thank you. How are you? We, we kiss in London, just so you know. Oh, all right, love you, all right. Hello, right. oh, nice to meet you, I'm Rich. Lovely to meet you, Val. <laughs> Why don't you explain quickly what neighbourhood is, because oh. he'll, he'll do it better than I do. And we are here in the neighbourhood in Islington. It's a space where we showcase pop-ups and residencies. Currently, we have Ivan Rahman doing a Mazaman concept. Particularly excited to swoon over one of the darlings of the industry, Sabrina. The infamous Rich Myers of Get Baked. The biggest potty mouth in the industry. Why, why are you here? Because you asked me to be here. Rich asked me to do a collaboration with him and no brainer because I absolutely love Get Baked and I love all the goodies that they make from the cookies to the pies to the cakes. So it was just about finding something that worked perfectly and I just happened to have mm. the perfect recipe. So I think we should go to the kitchen and uh, why don't we make the sauce? Have we chosen a name? Well, Sabrina's Sticky Toffee Coffee Cake. Uh, Stick, that was it. Say Stick, that five times. Sabrina's really Sticky Toffee Coffee Cake. That's actually quite good though. Say it five times. Sabrina's Sticky Toffee Coffee Cake. Sabrina's Sticky Toffee Cake. Sabrina's Sticky Toffee Coffee Cake. Sabrina's Sticky Toffee Coffee Cake. Sabrina's Sticky Toffee Cake. <laughs> As I'm Persian, um, I have to inject some of the Middle East into everything I do, which is why this Sticky Toffee Coffee Cake has a little bit of spice in there because it's like the coffees of the Middle East, Arab Middle East specifically. I've got two different kinds of sugar, I've got some butter, I've got some double cream, and then this is the important stuff. I've got a little bit of vanilla here, and we've got some espresso, cinnamon, to give it a really spiced effect, but it's really subtle and it works really well with all the other flavors in there, especially the coffee. And then this, my little secret star of the show, notes of cardamom, which works really, really well with coffee. Working with uh, Sabrina. Creative genius. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm very into these flavors anyway. And obviously we've done a sticky toffee in the past, but doing it with these flavors, I think it complements it really well. It's supposed to be stuff that you can make. But you do the work for it. But us. we do it. Yeah. And obviously, you know, we use really good ingredients, which massively helps. This Ooh. is the actual pudding, so the actual sponge. We use wild farm flour, which is obviously important to know. It's really, really good quality flour. We're going to sauce the f out. Why don't we do this? You do that. It's oh. a bit of a control for it. You're a bit of a control for it. I'm giving you your own. Right. Um, yeah, I'm sourcing Sabrina. Sabrina's being sourced right now. Perfection. And I want a little bit in the edges so that it sets beautifully. Then they brought the biryani over, and then they came over with the, like a like a parmesan. <laughs> the thing of parmesan. What like. kind of places do you frequent yeah. anyway? Are you going down here? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was like, um, this you... place is crazy. Right. Who, who thought? So, uh, don't tell me you don't know how to use them. I know things. how to use them, but I'm not good at it. Fine. So there's that. You've got. <laughs> it is extremely good to be fair. That little back flavour of coffee makes it like I'm sipping coffee in between a sticky toffee pudding. It's just there as a... Can I ask if you want a happy ending? So happy endings we make, ice cream sandwiches and soft serve. Our focus is on like great ingredients, nostalgia and fun. So the shortcake on this is phenomenal. And then there's a layer of like nostalgic strawberry. This one is most like a Maximum. Oh, what f me. Do you like that? Amazing. But I love this because it's like... Amazing. <laughs> One of our recommendations, obviously you can eat it naked, i.e. not you naked, but like with nothing else on it. But I'm a big fan of vanilla ice cream, even better than vanilla ice cream. This is Fiore di Latte ice cream, which is... <laughs> Why, do Why do you say... But that's what it's called! Don't say Fiore di Latte, what do you say? Fiore di Latte. <laughs> <laughs> what not to do with your pudding? Lovely to meet you. Lovely to yeah. meet you. And I'll see you in the neighbourhood too. I'm going to kidnap him. I might return him with or without a ransom note. God, these two. Sorry, Sabrina. Wrong one. 
Thank you. This was not He's like Buster Keaton of the dessert world. I don't know who Buster Keaton is. I'm a woman, I can open my own damn door. Are you sure? Are you good looking? <laughs> That's it, love. Just that. All the women independent. Going this way. <laughs> Taking your mic pack with us. <laughs>